I'm Mike Rooney. I'm a professional artist from Topsail Island, North Carolina. I do a lot of workshops. Uh, I start in Key West and I teach all the way up to Maine. The Lucas paints dry really, really quick. That's uh, probably one of the reasons that I use it is because it, I think it's that beeswax that's in it. There's a little bit of beeswax in it and it dries quicker than any paint I've ever used. And I think I've probably tried everything. But in a day, uh, most of the dark colors are dry and about a day and a half, even things that white is mixed in with are, are drying to the touch. So that's great for a plein air painter. Doesn't want to drag around a bunch of wet paint. Well, I love the way the Lucas oils feel because they're really buttery, they're really creamy from tube to tube. A lot of times you'll get a tube of paint, uh, let's say you've got another brand of paint and you, you're trying to squeeze it out of the tube, it doesn't want to come out of the tube, it's too stiff. Uh, other times it's too, too much oil, like even a lot of times when you open the cap, there's a lot of oil at the top. But uh, in some brands of paint, the oil is mixed all through the paint and you'll get a spot that's really oily. Lucas is buttery all the way through. Every single tube is exactly the same consistency, the same oiliness, and that's why I love the consistency, because when you're painting, you don't want consistency to change every tube you open up. You don't want to have to add medium to one color and no medium to another, so it's just a, a really nice buttery texture. Well, I, I do a lot of knife paintings. I could blend it with a knife. The blending part of the paint is excellent. I mean, you could blend it with a brush. And you can half blend it and let it streak. I mean, it does a, it does a good job of blending. I think the value of, of what you're getting for the money is it's, it's the equivalent of getting an $8 tube of paint, and, and if you bought another brand, it would be $16 or $20. I mean, you can't tell the difference, uh, and we all need to save money. I mean, artists are always trying to save money. And if you can get a, a $16 or two of paint for seven or eight dollars, who wouldn't buy that? Now I'm not going to buy a six or seven dollar tube of paint that doesn't cover. It's not creamy. It's got you know bad consistency or any of the issues I've talked about. But if it's the same paint as something that costs two or three times more, why would you go pay two or three times more? Well, I think the Lucas, I wouldn't use anything but Lucas, I'll, I'll just be honest with you. I'm sold on it 100%, wouldn't use anything else unless it was just absolutely none available and I had to do something. But the, the, the value, the consistency, the color range, I mean, there's, 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 I can't think of a downside. I mean, I'm, I try to think of one thing to be honest and say, you know, it's great, but, and I can't think of one thing that's a downside to that paint. I love the paint, I think it's the greatest paint around. I wouldn't, um, I wouldn't switch for anything unless they just quit making it.